Hey SeaWolves fans, today we are here with goaltender Ethan Taylor making his grand return to the team. Ethan, welcome back and thank you for joining me today. Thank you, I'm really excited to be here. Uh, what convinced you to return to the SeaWolves? You were here in October, you played the first couple of games and uh, it's been a long few months and you're back here in Biloxi. Yeah, basically I just saw what uh, Pacers done with the team and um, I uh, wanted to come back here, compete with the boys, and try and, uh, try and get a few more wins for uh, Mississippi. Between November and now, while you were away, what did you do to stay in mid-season shape? Uh, I was skating with the local junior team, and uh, I was uh, in the gym daily, just stay in shape. You were in net for the team's first win in FPHL history in Binghamton, and also solidified the first home win at the Coliseum. How proud are you of those accomplishments? Yeah, it's uh, it's great. I'm, I'm obviously really proud of it, and um, it means a lot that uh, they'd have me, they want me back, and to keep playing for them, and uh, hopefully get more wins in the near future here. The majority of players here are new. Is it kind of strange coming to a familiar place where things are so different? Yeah, definitely. Like walking into the room and only knowing a handful of the guys that were here when I was here. But uh, like first impressions, like all the guys seem uh, like great people and uh, great hockey players. So I don't see why things aren't going to work out real well here. One of the returning guys is Blake Wyrick, one of your fellow goaltenders. Do you enjoy working with him? Yeah, it's uh, great. I think we push each other to levels that we both need to hit to uh, achieve success. And um, we're also really good friends off the ice, and that makes it that much better. You talked about first impressions earlier. What do you know about how Joe Pace manages the team? Oh, so far I've seen just everyone seems relaxed and uh, like excited to go play. And um, it's just such a nice, nice uh, atmosphere to be in right now. And with all the uh, the new faces on the roster, and of course this is like your first day of practice, so there's still a lot of feeling out to do with your new teammates. Uh, but between the practice today and uh, the practice at the start of the season, have you noticed any differences at all with uh, the team overall? Yeah, I feel like definitely, uh, obviously a lot of guys are new and uh, whatnot, but um, I feel like this is just a really competitive team that, that really wants to win. Like you could see it today with every shot, every every stride they were, they were trying to uh, get better. Do you feel anxious at all about returning to the team and picking up the success you had back in October? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Just, um, you know, it's going to be hard to get back into that stride I was in when I was here because I was comfortable. I was in really good shape. I was feeling feeling good every time I was on the ice. And now, obviously, uh, it's, a, it's a new thing again, but... Uh, I don't see why I can't uh, get back to that. And our final question today, what are you looking forward to most when it comes to making your return? I'm really excited to hear the Coliseum, see, uh, watch all the fans, uh, hear them, and uh, just uh, get that big win under our belts and keep rolling. Well, being home, you get to see all the fans again. No better place to make that return. Ethan, again, thank you so much for joining us, and best of luck this weekend. Thank you. Everyone, that's goaltender Ethan Taylor on today's edition of Sea Wolves Digital Media.